In this Debaco University video, I'm going to be going over Rockwell size options for indoor cannabis plant production. It may be just more than what you're thinking of. A lot of growers use Rockwell at the early stages, but did you know it can be used throughout the full growth cycle? Here we're going to go over some of those options. All right, let's explore some of the options regard for Rockwell for your indoor cannabis plant production. So first off, Grodan Stonewall or Rockwool um, here. Uh, many brands, but this is a very popular one when both commercial and hobby growers. Rockwool is made from molten rock spun into a cotton candy-like fiber that is then compressed into cubes, blocks, or slabs. Because it's man-made, it does allow for the freedom to be made into a variety of shapes. Rockwell can absorb nutrient solution and help maintain aeration, which are both beneficial to the plant on both the small scale and also the large scale uh, growth production. So we'll want to look at the propagation stage, this is where people may be, or growers might be may f most familiar with Rockwell. Seedling startings in cubes are easily transferred into blocks and then into slabs if desired, so that, that makes it very advantageous. Seedlings or cuttings started in Grodan cubes can be transplanted into more traditional planters or also growing mediums. This is why people might be familiar with Rockwell at the starter stage and then might progress to other substrates. Grodin makes OK starter plugs, uh, macro plugs, and AOK -okay starter plugs just to give some examples there of the variety that you have even in just the propagation stage of production. We get into growing blocks as we can see here, used quite a bit, and we see the uh, clones here being grown in the little starter uh, plugs and then they're placed directly into its form fit into the blocks here. Those seedlings or cuttings started in these larger Grodan blocks, and once rooted, the blocks are then transferred to long, a larger stonewall slab. Grow blocks can also be planted directly into containers for soil gardening. And this is a strip of 4 inch by 4 inch Grodan blocks, each with preformed holes in them to accept those little starter plugs there. Makes for a very easy transfer, makes for a very efficient transfer, and also a very time efficient transfer as well, with minimal root disturbance. Now, growing slabs, Grodan slabs are used in the final stage of planting. These are kind of the largest. These slabs come in clearly marked UV resistant poly sleeves for ease of use. It's recommended for larger long-term crops with extensive root structures like cannabis, peppers, tomatoes, or even cucumbers. Typically, seedlings and blocks are uh, placed into the slabs as kind of the next level of progression in the grow cycle. Now lastly, combining the blocks in the slabs, what does that actually you know, kind of look like? Well, we can see some great examples of that here. This allows for minimal root disturbance as the two components naturally work together. They're also of the very similar material, so that's allowing those roots to kind of go through and transfer from one to the other very easily. So the block can be placed directly on the slab to allow the roots to continue growing from that block right into the slab. We see that here on the large production. We see that here kind of a zoomed in version. Well, what does it look like from the root standpoint? Well, this is kind of a great cutaway. We're seeing the roots that were initially started in that block have now progressed to and are starting to spread throughout the slab there, allowing for that expansion. So this is why Rockwell um, can be used from the very start to the very end because of the options that it provides and the root friendly and plant therefore print plant friendly environment that it can create throughout the propagation stage all the way to the final harvest stage.